Remote riding is interesting. I won't say that we were lost, but I will admit that after a while, we really didn't know where we were. Having said that, we were always comfortable that we could find our way back because we had stuck to the trails, mostly. Can't wait to get home and look at a map, see where I am. This is really good for them, SJ. They're going up a hill. Yeah. They rock. They have to pick their way. It's hot. And it's quite a hill, and it's hot. Decent speed. And it's just enough shade. There's not too many flies. Cole is certainly a different ride with shoes on. Well, this is pretty. There's butterflies. Oh my gosh, Zim, you're trippy as can be, my love. Yeah. Cantered up that hill. Cantered. I cantered up that hill. Oh, did you? Yep. Up yeah. I don't I think we were a bit farther behind, so we wanted to catch up. Four miles. Four miles, and even though we're on a beautiful trail, we couldn't be more in the middle of the woods. And we're on nicer roads than have they have coming off the highways. Four miles. We are in the middle of the woods. We are in the middle of the woods. Ooh, we don't know what's in here. We're just going, just going down, down. Lean back, lean back. He's fine. He's having a great time eating his maple trees with his shoes on, his little tooties all protected. Fly it's just so unknown. This doesn't even look like this. No. <laughs> What's going on up here? Lynn, where are we? Lost in the woods and singing really loud. Beaver houses on the right. The beaver dam? It's a beaver dam now. Oh, you can get through that. Says the girl behind the girl in the front. Cole has other ideas. I could get off maybe and take him. Do you want me to try? Leading? Yeah. Yeah. As he might. You never know. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Oh. Come on. Go. Well. So what is it? Let's talk this through. We gotta go over that way because of the prairies. Yeah. And how deep do you think that might could be? Not that deep. I don't think it's that deep. Alright, if I could lift that branch up. Yeah. Come on, Colt. There you go. Huh? And we're through. That is quite the dam system. It's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So let's recap. We are almost five miles in. Somewhere between two trails that we knew about, 
on a trail we've never been on that now has gravel down on it and <laughs> we think it's running parallel to the two trails we know oh no now look sj there's a trail that way and a not great one this way i think we have to go left go left yeah yeah well, that let me make let me see if the gravel stays here let's oh yeah no i see that okay hold on it's overgrown this way buddy yeah well we know about this it'll pick up on our gps as if yeah. <coughs> there is a road going that way yeah totally different terrain again huh well i guess it's more of a natural train, that one. <laughs> yeah, completely different, eh? I'm gonna take a drink while it gets good. Oh, me too, then. Don't take, pick up a... Oh, oh, I know, I know. Oh, I did the thing. What happened? The water bottle. Oh, geez, he's really on edge today. I told you. Like, that hasn't bothered him in years. Careful, this is rocky cool. It's really good training for the 30 because it's really challenging. Is uh -oh. that? Just uh, like a, oh, please don't be the end of the road. No, it's a gravel pit, I guess. Where do we go? Right down here, I think. This is crazy. I regret this day forevermore, not having gloves on. Fly spray, uh-oh, we're stuck. What? Big log across. Oh, wait now. Or is it just a log? What's going on here, Cole? Well, I think that's, I don't know. You go there, Lynn. Where? There. Really? Yeah. Let's do it, I guess. Yeah. No, it looks like someone tried to build a bridge there. Oh, okay. This, it's, uh, you have to be careful. Do you think we should forget it for today? It's so short. Cole, come. Be careful. All right, this is really hey. steep. Oh. Come on. Come on. Hope. Oh. Watch. Stop rushing, buddy. Hey, not. Azim, pay attention. Come on. Come on. Watch out, he doesn't jump. On top of you. All right, you. Good boy. Maybe it was a gravel pit at one time. Okay, we need to find somewhere to get on. Hey, bear and deer and anything else. Mostly bears. Don't kill us. We've come to a roadblock. Where this ends today. Um, I walked through it with my boots and got so far and then started to get wet. And the problem is so much a trail up there and I don't want to go like 20 feet, have to turn around anyway. Six miles and we've been at it for almost two hours. Oh, you took him over that, brand, that uh, log. Awesome. Well done. All right. Come on, you can do it. Come on. So come away with me, nobody else to. And sometimes. Really wasn't sure where the trail was, but Cole has a 
second sense for figuring this stuff out. Isn't that pretty? Ooh, storm clouds coming in. Catch up. Well, Cole, we're going to get full marks for time in the saddle, full marks for riding obstacles and exploring. Very poor mark for speed. Yeah, but they worked, man. They worked, I know, and so have we. Six miles. Hey, bear. This is definitely bear territory. It feels berry. It does. And I don't think many people come up here. No. But we're on our way back now, so I'm not as concerned. Yeah. I feel a lot better being on a horse. Yeah. Honestly, I wouldn't like hiking this. It's a little too remote, a little too close. Yeah. Like a bear could be on the other side of those bushes. And exactly. You wouldn't, you wouldn't be able to see because there's a lot of like sparseness in between those trees. Yeah. <laughs> you want to see Lynn and SJ go through that lake in a hurry? Ha! Just put a bear in front of us right now. Oh, we'd be through that lake like yeah. you won't believe. So it is even go. Yeah, so we would all be through the <laughs> freaking lake. <laughs> what lake? Yeah, what lake? <laughs> I didn't see no lake. Mountain horses today. Can we focus on surviving and not eating for a second? Yeah, I maybe? do worry when they're so focused on eating that they're not paying attention. This is pretty steep, Cole. Come on. Come on. Slow and steady wins the race, my love. And forth. Nope. Ugh. Okay. Okay. So it does have a bad habit of wanting to come exactly the same way I come. It's going to get way over here. Come oh, on, buddy. I'm leaving you behind. Yeah, I walked through that like it was nothing. Oh, well, maybe that's the benefit of eating. Oh, and then he almost fell. And he doesn't care. Come on. Well, this is pretty steep, Cole. I laugh when I listen to the beginning of the videos and we're so fresh. Oh, we'll call this Maple Lane. And by now we're like, oh my God, another maple tree, another get off, get on. And it's uphill and we just want to make a little bit of time. I'm getting hot and tired. Cole is much more focused on his way out, way in, he was all about eating. I don't know if you guys feel or if he just wants out. Big. Uh, now we're going downhill. We can do it. Pretty easy downhill here. On our way home. Beautiful breeze. My gosh, it's gorgeous out. Can't wait to get home and look at a map. See where I am. I sense a commitment. Yes. <laughs> Let's walk over this, buddy. Oh, 
Oh good, we're back on that gravel road. SJ, let's go this way just till we can't. Okay, I'm talking loud. She's talking loud. So we don't get eaten by bears. This may be where we turn around today, but this I think is the one we should have been on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I yeah, will try. Oh! Uh, okay, we're good. No, we're not. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what to do. Crazy. The other reason I need gloves is because early in the season, coal needs to be rocked back a lot more. And I just can't do it as easily. Flies start at him. Part of the reason he wants to go faster. All right, let's try a little trot. This is good road. All right, come down for a minute. Take care of it. Boy, that guy flew away with a PC, didn't he? Ho, 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 ho. Ho, ho. All right, get it if you want it. There was a big old fly on him. Want a drink? Ah, oh, frogs. The rocks are a lot softer coming back because it rained. We didn't even know it while we were down in the gully. It poured rain all over these rocks. Branches are wet. <clears throat> okay, so 10 miles. Azim's feet were a little trippy, yes? Yes. Cole, a couple, but not nothing like Azim. Cole was very committed on the way back, but now he has lost track of the fact that we're on the way back. He's not committed again. Azim, we picked up a canner, a couple of what do we call those things? You guys always call them crow hops. Crow hops. Unfortunately, very frustrating. And anyway, we gabbed a half of the way back with some ideas about what to do. And we will implement them all, and you can come along with us and find out if they work or not. It is Cole. Home sweet home. Ten miles in. We won't talk about the speed, but, oh, very interesting. <laughs> you always start. I know, I know. I just brained it. So, it was a great ride. It was. And it was an extraordinary Happy trails. <laughs>